Welcome to CIS 18 Explanations with Stetson Cyber Group. CIS Control 2 Inventory and Control of Software Assets Mike and Bob are working in the office. Bob is trying to transfer money, files, and data to Mike, but Mike is struggling with some technical problems. Frustrated, Mike went to the help desk at his office to see what was wrong with his device. Oh, looks like a Windows 7 software. That's not up to date. That's why nothing's working. The recent patches haven't been able to apply to your machine. Is that a problem? Yes, it's actually a big problem. Cyber criminals prey on vulnerable versions of software that could be exploited. To stop this from happening, CIS2 recommends you maintain an up-to-date list of all authorized software that is required in the enterprise. Ensure that software applications and operating systems are currently supported by the vendor. Lastly, use software inventory tools throughout the organization to automate the documentation of all software on business systems. In addition, the software inventory system should track the name, version, publisher, and installation date for all software and operating systems. Also, ensure that unauthorized software is removed and the inventory is updated in a timely manner. Finally, you should use application whitelisting technology on all assets to ensure that only authorized software executes. Ow, I did not even think of this. I will take a look at all my company's software afterwards. Here are some key takeaways. Identify and document all software. Develop an approved software whitelist. Manage software through regular scanning and updates. Thanks for watching, guys. And remember, stay cyber safe.